Welcome to Wait a Minute, It's Advent. Today, on the second Thursday of Advent, we hear from Tanya. Let us take a moment to pause and pray. Stir up our hearts, O Lord, to make ready the paths of your only begotten Son, that through his coming we may be found worthy to serve you with minds made pure. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God for ever and ever. Amen. Hope. It isn't a word that you really hear much around here. Seems like you're always too busy trying to get to the end of the day to think about what the next one might have in store. If you do ever think about tomorrow, the past tells us it will probably look a lot like today. Miserable, but that's not how it's supposed to be. You see, a long time ago, we were given a promise that our life would be better. Isaiah chapter 9 verses 2 says, The people walking in the darkness have seen a great light. On those living in the land of darkness, a light has dawned. A baby was promised. It's not just a regular baby like you and me. This baby is going to change the world. He was going to give hope to everyone who believed in him. Therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. The virgin will conceive and give birth to a son and will call him Emmanuel. Emmanuel, God with us. God himself was going to come down to earth to be with us. Praise the Lord. 